Michelle Easter began her career as a fashion model at age 15. She's had an international career, appearing in runway shows in New York, Dubai, Athens, London, Paris, Milan, and she's been featured in countless magazines like Teen Vogue, Cosmopolitan, and Condé Nast Traveler. She recently left modeling to study mechanical engineering with a concentration in robotics. She's worked at the Air Force Research Laboratory for two summers and then at Princeton University in their mechanical and aerospace engineering department. She's got a 4.0 GPA and she's even written articles for the Journal of Applied Physics. I'm so pleased that Michelle is here today to chat with us about her love of Italian fashion. Thank you so much for being here today. Of course. So tell me, what does Italy mean to you? What significance, what connection do you have with Italy? So Italy reminds me of this time in my life. Um, it was a few years back. And it was this time when I really realized that I had so much freedom. Um, I was young, I was super into fashion. I had just signed with a new manager and he sent me to Milan. Um, and it was an amazing experience. Uh, it was one of my first times spending a really extended period of time in this like really romantic culture, um, being around castles and fashion and nice food and uh, you know artists and all this stuff. It was a really amazing time. So you spent time on the runways of Milan? Yeah, for sure. It was really nice. A little bit of runway. I'm a little petite for runway. So I did this diesel show and some uh, art magazines there and stuff. It was really nice. Why? Runway models have to be larger? Um, usually runway girls are pretty tall. So I'm 5'9". Um, there are some runway girls that are 5'9", but usually they want them 5'11", 6 foot, very tall. The clothes just really hang and look so nice on this long, lean frame. So. What Italian designers do you like? Um, so some of my favorite ones are these designers like Cavalli and Missoni. They have amazing prints. Uh, Cavalli, all their animal, and Missoni, their knits are so nice. Um, and they also have like Fendi with these really classic, beautiful, chic designs. I love their campaigns. Super high fashion. Speaking of beautiful designs, you're wearing <laughs> something you picked up in, in Milan? Yeah, I got this dress. It's vintage Anti Prima. And I got it at this really amazing flea market in uh, Milan, like right off the river. And it was only 50 euros. I can't believe it. It was such a steal. And shoes, do you love the Italian shoes? I love the Italian shoes, for sure. And what about the Italian designers and just the Italian scene when you were there? Did you enjoy working with Yeah, them? it was really fun. Um, about the Italian scene, the Italians love to party. Um, I did a lot of that in Milan, too. It was really fun. Um, this uh, Armani Privé and like Hollywood and all these really fun clubs. Um, especially like as, as models, they would you know round us up in groups and take us out to these nice clubs. It was super fun. Milan, doing a runway show, being around the scene of all those models and designers. What was it like? Really, really fun. Uh, it was a big, a big show, uh, male and female, which is always fun because we get to work together. Uh, really funky fashion. Uh, we had a choreographer, which is really nice. Uh, we got to go out of town too. We went out to uh, Padua. It's like kind of like more in the countryside, which is really beautiful. So it's like a little model field trip. What are castings? So casting is like a job interview for models, and you basically just show up, get in line with all the other girls, you have your book of uh, your portfolio, your images, and you wait to see clients. And depending on what the job is, maybe they have you walk for them, try on some clothes, take some pictures of you, or whatever, whatever it is that they want to see you do. <laughs> and you've now segued into the aerospace mechanical engineering. I've got my one fact about Italy and aerospace. <laughs> Do you know that in Italy, the um, aerospace division is asked some great chefs to create pasta for the astronauts. Oh my gosh. And even espresso so they can have it in outer space. Wow, these are going to be the best fed astronauts in the game for sure. <laughs> it's a great combination of that high tech with the love of wonderful food. Yeah, absolutely. That's amazing. I didn't know that. Very cool. Thank you so much for sharing My a little pleasure. bit of your experience. Of course.